I thank God for your life. I thank you for tuning in. The Lord is good and his mercies endures forever. First, I will enjoy you in his word in Ephesians 4 and 24 that says to keep on righteousness and holiness. Put on a new man in righteousness and holiness. The Bible let us know that we have been created by God for that purpose in righteousness and holiness. Keep in it, move in it and have your being in it. The word for today that we are discussing, the target word today is work. W O R K work. I'm sure some of you are preparing to go to work. You are headed for the station, for the bus stop, or rushing off into your car to get to work. I pray that you continue to find favor at work, that you continue to enjoy your work, and the Lord will bless the work of your hand. This day, as we discuss on the target word work, Work is good. The Bible wants us to work. It says so that there will be bread. It said there is no food for lazy man. It says the one that does not work will not eat. And the bread of idleness, the Bible says we should not eat. It wants us to work in so that we can produce results. The Bible talks of the virtuous woman. We saw how tenacious Solomon was with things of wisdom so that he made his kingdom to be so pronounced that the queen of Sheba came over and that is how God God Almighty will prosper your work my dear listener even as you are tenacious with your work the Bible says that you should serve your bosses your superiors as you are doing unto the Lord it says no eye service God wants perfection he wants us to be the light in the office to stand out so that somebody would take a clue from you so that somebody will say there's something special about your life and Before you know it, you are ministering, you are evangelizing, you are making impact because you have stood out at work. May God bless your work in Jesus' name. Have a fruitful day. God bless you.